Shipping U.S. soybeans to Pacific Northwest export ports like this one saves time and freight costs, and that's a huge advantage for producers in the Northwestern Corn Belt. We used to be the tail end of the marketing system that went to China. Today, we're the closest market to China. That provides a huge shipping advantage versus going through the Gulf of Mexico. When you talk about shipping from the Pacific Northwest to uh, China, we can cut about eight days off that trip. Which greatly reduces ocean freight rates. It can be tens and hundreds of thousands of dollars difference in freight costs on a load of, uh, of soybeans. And that savings has increased export demand for U.S. soybeans and greatly improved basis levels and prices for farmers in the Western Corn Belt. We were getting up towards a dollar negative uh, basis on soybeans. You know, and today, uh, many times, that's 40, 50 cents, and, and even right now, we're at a positive basis. This Heartland Consumer Report is sponsored by South Dakota Soybean Farmers in their soybean checkoff.